Hey everyone, welcome back for more good vibes and video games. And real quick, I have something completely unrelated to Hogwarts Legacy to show you. Look at this adorable little pumpkin that I made when I went to a glass blowing session a couple weekends ago. I had a gift certificate that I got two years ago and I finally put it to use. And now I have this adorable little decoration that I am so incredibly proud of. No, I didn't make it 100% myself. I had a lot of help from some incredibly talented glass artists, but I did have a little bit of input, okay? So just wanted to show that off and I have the perfect place for it. All right, without further ado, thank you guys so much for being here and clicking on today's video. I really hope you like this episode of Hogwarts Legacy. So let's keep playing. Gosh. I'm not gonna lie to you, okay? I haven't been having the best day, but there is something about this game that it like it's almost as if when I turn it on everything that has been happening or going on before this it's like it doesn't even matter anymore it, it's just like this makes me so happy it is it is Deke able you should be to yep Deke I know yep those 10,369 giggity times that I've heard that one too ha <laughs> okay anyway what I was saying this game makes me happy that's it. That's all she wrote. That's all I have to say for today. Also, more more exciting news. Um, pff, as if I wasn't gonna give you another tour of my room requirement. Again, redesigned for the hundredth time. I'm so happy. Um, we still got our Thestral. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I was just free roaming the other day and I came across something random. I don't even know where I was or what I was doing. I was probably killing some people. I mean, knocking them out because I don't, I don't use the unforgivable curses. But I found this adorable bookcase. I was, oh my god, I was so stoked that I got this. I immediately came back, set it up here. So it's the botanical bookcase with this new, like, oh, I think the sitting room. I don't think I've changed it since last time I showed you. But then I added it on both sides because symmetry is good for us. At least, well, good for me. It keeps my heart rate low. Um... We got the unicorn statue that I will never remove from this room. Uh, I'll be dead in that case. Oh, actually, I forgot to say, I changed the lighting of the room, too. To, instead of the earthy natural, it was, like, warm and cozy. Like, the way this game makes me feel warm and cozy. And it actually has, surprisingly, changed the, the, the feeling of this room a little bit. Love the Hippogriff statue. There's my Venomous Tentaculae. Still my desk doing its- Oh my god, I love this lighting so much more, I think. It just- it feels so much more realistic, too. I don't- I don't know. Just- All the Moonstone is cooking. Alright. <gasps> oh, I almost forgot! Wait! Let's go say hi to the pets. The babies. Oh, yeah, because I got some other stuff to show you guys, too. Because oh, I, ah, I just remembered that... Oh, my gosh. I came across some a lot of furniture items the other day, and I was so excited. Um, You're all adorable. Do I want to harvest? Well, you know what? Since they all got to eat anyway, actually. We just brush them while we're here, right? You know what I'm saying? Wait, let's go to this one. I switch these out anyway. You're so cute. You're so cute. The Irondale Pilfer. I got some poopers. God. God, this game has this weird ability to make me so freaking happy. Like, it's like nothing. It's like nothing matters before this. Nothing. Nothing. I just get to unplug my brain for like six hours. Oh my gosh. I just realized, I just had an epiphany why video games are so addictive. You're so cute, go get your food! No, I, I need you to go get your food because that's the only way I'm gonna be able to collect it. It's fine. It's fine, I'll come back. We got the special moon calf. You're adorable. Gosh darn you. Gosh darn- go eat your food. Go eat your food. Oh, you already did. You need to eat too. All y'all need to eat. 
That's why I built this for you. And a little toy box. Oh my gosh. Okay. I like them all to play together, even though there's balls for specific uh, species. Like, this is good for the moon cat. This is good for the niffler. Obviously, because it's shiny balls. Shiny balls. Ha ha ha. ha. Pause for laughter. It's a slimy ball made for from bogeys. I don't want to read that anymore. Nope. Nope. I don't do boogers or snot. It's snot nice. Feel free to unsubscribe after that one. It's fine. I, I'm not- I'm not upset. This one's for the deer calls. Phoenixes! Phoenixes! <gasps> that just reminded me! Oh my god, I know exactly what we're doing immediately. First thing on the agenda for today. But we're gonna- we're gonna let them play with a ball. All of them. So damn cute. Oh my god, if that's not the dopamine that you needed today, I don't know what is. I don't know- if you can't smile after this... I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I, I would offer a hug, but I'm afraid that that won't even work. And, uh, yes, we have to talk to Deke. <gasps> would you- oh my gosh, could you remind me where to go to find the phoenix? Deke. Could you remind me where I need to go to find the phoenix? We're gonna do this. Of course. Deke has heard rumors of a phoenix nest on a nearby mountaintop. But do be careful. As Deke said, poachers will most certainly be looking for Good. it. Good. Good. Uh, I need practice. I need practice. Um, gonna collect some of these. I made- I was making some fertilizer earlier. So that's kind of cool. You can go. Oh, let, let me show. Yeah, this is a new addition too. I almost forgot to to show you. Okay, so I discovered fertilizer. Those things that make it the dung dung cop the poop the poop poster the poop composter. Um, so you can make fertilizer, and you can actually go over to the physical plant that you want to yield more, and you can add it. And that was a fun little discovery the other day. Um, oh, I almost forgot to. I need to identify some gear real fast. Oh, we got a new scarf. Alright, I just put on my new scarf, and whoop, the loom's over here. I'm gonna adjust it in the loom. Alright, so all that has been upgraded, and, and now I have- Oh my gosh, my Defendo is about to be so disgustingly OP, and I can't wait to use it on someone. <gasps> Let's switch this back. Let's go capture a phoenix! Oh my gosh, and we finally get to go into an area of the map that I have never been to before. I've been wanting to search this this lower section for so long. And I, again, have a massive list of stuff and quests and content that I get to go through today. So uh, I, I hope it's going to be a good video. I feel like it's going to be a really fun one. Wait, wait, wait. Am I having to go... Through here to get to the other side? You haven't had mushroom stew like what my mother used to make. Like heads of lettuce, those mushrooms. Cool story, bro. <laughs> oh, what the heck? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, then. Oh! Oh, no, it's one of those fun chests. Yes. Yes. Cannot forget about these. Wow, there's a lot of- Wow, there's a lot of things happening here. Oh my god, there's a troll. I should've used it on him. Crapola. These trolls, man. Their second hit gets me every time. You know what? Maybe- oh, no, again, second- second one every time. Ah! What?! Stop it! I don't know why it's like I can't get far enough away from him. I'm gonna start throwing crap at him. Boom. Oh, little moon calf. Oh, you did! Hey. Eh? Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Okay, sure. Yep. i throw you at your buddy. Is there anyone still alive? Uh, uh, yeah, he did. 
All right, where was I before I was so rudely injured? Oh, there's one more guy. Oh, oh, stay away. Whoops. There we go. Now he's done. So I think I gotta go through that that massive cave tunnel thing. Revenia. Where was the? Oh, there it is. Ooh, nice. There's a Merlin trial up there. Do we want to do it? What do you have right? in store for me this time? Well, I guess my character's all about it. So there's those. Well, they normally is three sets of three balls. Three balls. Where's the third set? Pavelio. Hmm. A lot of goodies to loot around here, though. No, I say, I say while we're here, even though I've got all of the collections, prizes, rewards for doing Merlin Trials, I think there's, I hope there's still an achievement for, for getting all of them. Bombada. Very. Very, very cool. Boom! Oh. Well, are the last ones. They're not too far away. Oh my. Oh wow. I love this. Yeah. This is mad, dude. Pavelio. You heard nothing. You heard nothing. Who is it? An intruder! Uh, intruder! Rebellion. R.I.P. I was young when I almost fell out of a car at Gringotts. Wait! Wait, 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 like the carts, like the roller coaster Revenia. cart thing? You would just fall to your death. I don't know how he's still here, I would love for him to explain. Where is that? Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is! Yes. There we go. Bombada. Boom. Oh, there is last one. That's that. Sassy. That's that. One more closer. All right, what was I doing? Revelio. Great question. Just really want what's in this bag. That's fine. Oh wait, wait, wait! I can't forget about this chest. Oh my goodness. When I say welcome back at the beginning to Hogwarts Legacy, I really should be saying welcome back to Sidetracked Simulator. No, 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 sir. No need. I'll come to you. Take this guy out quickly. No. No. Boom! Ow! Boom! Done. Dead. That was a close one. Um. Rebellion. <laughs> Troll bogies, boogies. Ooh, not the kind of boogie I like. Mm -mm. I like to boogie, not see, touch, oh, uh, watch someone pick their boogie. Look, bro, I'm just thinking about it. Okay, uh, off topic. Get off the topic of that. Okay. Whew. All right, let's, uh, I think, I think I gotta go through this way.
I can't even mount my broom here. Where am I? Where? Where the hell am I? What? I was only following. Woo! Hi. Bombard. Never mind. Pavelio. Money. Throw it at him. Somebody there. Hello? Nope. Your mom. And she's very disappointed. Always my turn for patrol. Super weird that you call me that. Wait, 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 wait. Did my Defendo just break through that shield? My Defendo's so OP. Boom! You would think having them be frozen would maybe, like, do damage over time for, like, a couple seconds. So that, that would be, like, a cool... Because, like, I don't know about you, but, like, being frozen like that, not good for your health. Ah. Your blood's on Revelio. Your blood's on Revelio. <laughs> we yes, yes, yes. We know their blood is on Ranrock's hands or something about Ranrock. <laughs> oh no! How could I have missed this? What is this? This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. No, I can't. I truly, I cannot imagine. Can you please explain it to me? We need a documentary on this, on how inconvenient it was before you invented flu powder. I would, I would absolutely love to know more. I'm so intrigued. You know, I, I just, I can't forget it at this point. I've heard it so many times. <laughs> I I make fun of it in jest, by the way. I don't at all think think it's really an I, I think it's so funny to be honest. It's it's a meme at this point. I think it makes this game so charming. Boom. Dead zone. Hello, sir. Boom. Oh, there is nothing there. That's nice. Oh, where am I? Where am I? God, where are there so many? Oh, oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I need to look at the mini map. I guess this is one good thing about the mini map is knowing like what's a dead end and what's not. Ooh, nice. Yes. I think we're good. Oh, there's money. Move bones! Move bones! Oh, that's right! No! Why is the world so unfair? The coin purse was like, nah, I'm out. Ew! Whoa! Wait! Oh, how cool! I mean... It is kind of overcast and cloudy out, so I can't really see it, but it looks very mountainous. Emphasis on the mountains. Let's see here, what is this? Antique compass. Unfortunately, the fact that this antique muggle compass was dropped here means the muggle who dropped it is probably wandering through Wales by now. <laughs> very cool. Cool, we are finally got to the other side of the map, and it really seems like it's kind of separated from everything because of this cool little, little, uh, detour. Monday? Ooh, 17, that's my lucky number. Seventeen. Ooh, my lucky number again! See, I see it everywhere. 
couldn't tell you why. Do we just go? <gasps> oh, this kind of reminds me, like at the beginning of the game. Revenia. Just realize I really have not been tracking where I'm going. Kind of want to go about this for a little bit on foot, so that I can try to see as much as I can. Revenia. So I'm really forced to explore instead, because like it's easy to get everywhere by broom. Let's go take these dudes out, make them regret life. <laughs> my favorite. I think that's my favorite one. <laughs> Do you want it? Oh, I almost just blew myself up. Where are you, sir? Let's get this over with. Defendo! Do Defendo with the. You only have Ooh. one rock to blame. With the level 3. Like. Uh, what do you call it? Rune, I guess? For, like, your armor slot or whatever? O. O. P. And what, we're allowed to have six pieces of gear on our character at any given time? And if you put that on all of them, I mean, it would have to stack. It, maybe it would stack? To a certain amount, I want to go pop these. Oh, this place is so cool looking. Like this, this looks kind of darker, like of an area. Oh, nice. Oh my gosh, there's like a Rebellion. little beachy area. A lot of hidden stuff. Trolls. Trolls galore. Okay, hold on. I want to go back up and just kind of follow along this path. I really just wanted to look at that waterfall. Look how cool that is. Wow. I just really wanted to see, um, or I really wanted to pop the balloons. That's it. Cool! Oh, look at that! Oh, that's right. That reminds me. That's how I got the bookcase. I found- I came across, um, another separate little butterfly thing that I f Ooh, let's go look over there. What are they saying? Oh my god, that's so bad. That's- that's my brain. So I followed it and I found the bookcase. So it looks like a lot of those butterfly things will have- Wow, this place! Oh, yes! We're gonna take everyone out. So it seems like those butterfly chests have a lot of really, really awesome loot. Boom! I'm in no mood for you! I don't remember caring! That won't work! No! Yeah, I'm tough. You're dead. I don't pay for anything in games. I steal it. <laughs> no, you don't. Boom. Nah. Not today. Where is... Ooh. Ooh. I don't know what this is. Oh. This looks like a side thing. Henrietta's map. Ooh, yay, another treasure chest or another treasure map hold on so oh gosh so it looks like you we might have to use glacius and incendio at some point and then we're gonna come across like a hippogriff puzzle and the location is there and then we gotta look for like big like a big church looking ruin hmm. the location marked on the map isn't far from here <gasps> well that's great news that's great news! Rebellion. That's the best news I've heard all day. We got a straggler? Goodness. Not, not a party to attend by myself. Rebellion. What? How do I get in here? Maybe I gotta go inside? How do I get inside? Oh, found it. 
Oh, this is I killed everybody. You want a piece of this? You want a piece of this? You want a piece of this? I'm having a day. Right. <laughs> right. That works. I love, I love it. Boom. Expelliarmus in the face. Maybe the, it looks like the chest can be got here. I'm right. And look, I'm right. That never happens. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is not a drill. This is not a drill. Did I just get another- Oh! Yes! 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Best outfit in the bloody game. Bar none. Nothing, nothing even comes remotely close to this. This is the coolest thing. I really wish I would have had this for the Haunted Hogsmeade quest. Because I just feel like it would have... Oh my god, I feel like it would have fit in so freaking well. I'm so sorry. I got so stupid hype for that. This doesn't even... This does not even require... Uh, you, you don't, you, I don't even, this is kind of a cool look, not gonna lie. I don't think you need, what is that? That is actually a really sick, oh, oh, oh I kind of like it. What the heck? <gasps> I didn't, I, I didn't think that Hogwarts fashion could get any better and it did i challenge this game to give me a better outfit okay because frankly i just i would love to see it i would love to see it this is the coolest thing Th this is in fact the best outfit Lo i love that like cropped corset outfit that they keep giving me and then they keep giving me different variations of it and that is the best variation that just made me so happy highlight of today there's a lot going on and i still haven't even gone to the objective yet <laughs> I, haven't... I love going back to the exploratory phase of this game like i feel like i haven't explored a new area i thought you were gonna tell me how i can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before you invented flu powder i am disappointed in you I want my money back now. Oh, there it is! What are you gonna eat now? What are you eating? What did you scoop up this time? Oh, there it is. Another victim claimed. Next time I see Fig or that student. Excuse me? Oh, you shit talk, you die. Right back at you. That's what you get for talking You've smack. Less follower, Van Rock. Psh, psh. Keep my name out your mouth. Revelia. Ooh, let's do this. Ah, so we got to get in here. Wait, I wonder if I can. I don't think I can climb in through that. A little more. Right. Rebellion. Let's look around, shall we? Ooh, love to see it. Let's incendio. There we go. Boop. Collect. Collect. Incendio. Rebellion. Um. Hold on. Incendio. So get here. Gotta use that first. Oh, there it is. I see one. Revelio. 
I could probably use Bombarda for this. Duh. Give, give me. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, somebody gave up their ancient magic on the toilet. That was rough. I know exactly where this is going to go. There it is. Accio. Accio. Guardian Leviosa. That down quite violently. Rebellion. Looks like we got to incendio. Burn that. <laughs> My freaking outfit. And the last one I hope is up here. Rebellion. Uh -huh. Yes. Excuse me. Boo! Shame I didn't have an audience for that one. <laughs> well, she doesn't know if this is this this is getting posted on YouTube, so there is an audience for this. Oh no, it's fine. Cool. One more thing done. Back to exploring. Hi, cat. I can't go anywhere without petting this cat. So adorbs. These cats are so cute. I want one, like, in real life. I want a Siamese. I want whatever th that is. I think it's a Bengal cat. I think. I could be wrong. I don't know my cat breeds like I know my doggy breeds. But. Whatever. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Party time. Party time! Ah. <laughs> Oh, that was cool! <sighs> One less poacher in the wizarding world. <laughs> Savage. Alright. I actually think we're pretty close to the first destination of today. Feels like I've already done so much. But, like, I've seen so much already. It felt like we have not done any missions yet. Wait to get a phoenix. Troll! Die! Sorry, I gotta kill this thing first. Oh, oh my god, I pressed R1 instead of triangle. The ding dong. Oh, I thought he was gonna hit. He's gonna try to protego that. Didn't work. No. This gets me on the second. No. Uh. There we go. Rebellion. Oh, is this like a a troll tent? Oh, that's kind of cool. That is kind of cool. Okay. Back to what we were doing before. Getting sidetracked. Race you! I'm racing the local wildlife. Phoenix Mountain Cave. Oh, cool. Okay. Should I feel like I should get the get the nab sack ready, right? Yes. That's what I don't know. That's what I'm gonna do. Phoenix Rising. Blockade. Stalkwood's poachers are already here. Love to see them try. Oh, there's a chest. Rebellion. Below me. This must be below me. Huh. Huh. Obstacles, no problem. Incendio. Bombarda. Wait a sec. All right, well, I'm inclined to believe that that's the right way to go, so I want to see what's down here. Avelio. Could the phoenix be in there? 
Oh, this, okay, okay. So this this is the right. Where to go? What? What's up here then? Oh, I'm so confused. Okay, maybe no. this is the right rebellion. See how much a go. single feather fetches. Ha 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 ha! Whoa, hey, nice try, dude. Maybe next time. Incendio. Rebellion. What is this way? <laughs> that music. Done. Chicken that. My gear slots are full. Should have sold stuff before I came on this quest. Sorry to bombard you with that. I don't know why I spammed that, to be quite honest with you. I, I did it. I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again. Hold on a second, though. How do I get this? I don't think I can just crawl right through that. No, I can't. There's another way around. Where is it? What happens if I go down below, though? There's that lower part. This is clearly it. Incendio. No, 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 can I attack him again? I did. Boom. Alright. It's gonna bother me that I didn't keep going down that cage to see what was down there. But it all seemed like the right way to go. Let's just let's just follow this. I'm gonna try to remember. Ooh. Revelio. More poachers. Yes. How many are there? Lots. Lots and hitting you in the face with your friend that is now a barrel. How's the view? How's your view of the floor? Oh, the days are over. <laughs> no, her li her living days are over. Um. don't know where I'm going or if it's the right way or if it's the wrong way. Let's just keep going. Level 3 lock! Oh, that was just an instant unlock. <gasps> the Phoenix! Oh, wow! It's huge! It almost seems as if it wants me to follow it. Follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. Absolutely, let's go. It likes me. Oh no 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 no. No you don't. No you don't. Go away. Rebellion. Am I supposed to get over there? Jump? Okay. Yeah, that works. Can't carry any more Wigan welds because I'm so- Oh, rip me. Why does loot always get me killed? Boom. 5,000 damage, though. So good. So good. Revenia. Revelio. Alohomora. Ooh, what's in here? It's behind a level 3 lock. Your gear slots are full, not for long. 
Vicarious Vest School Uniform. Pavelio. I wonder if that's a new one. Where are we going? Where is this thing taking me? There it is again. What? 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 Where? Your eyesight must be better than me because I didn't see it. Oh god, that camera that scared me. Revenia. Oh, here it is. Bleach juice. Mm. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. How do I get up there, though? How on earth? Oh, I wonder if I can go up here and then drop down on top of it. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Yup. Incendio! <laughs> Mine now. Come on. Rustic garb. Ooh, I have that. <gasps> Revelio. Cool. Wait. 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 Incendio! I think we gotta go up that way. Oh, it's killing me inside. Where did that other way down go? Oh, kind of mad I didn't follow it. It had signs, and like we're following signs to go to the right place. So I just naturally thought that that was the right way to go. Maybe I'll have the opportunity. To oh, go back. Can we go back now? Hell no! Hell no! Die! I wish you would just make it quick! Bye, bye, I guess. Haha, <laughs> defeat spiders. Halfway to a hundred. Yeah. Pavelio. Anything else over here? Alright, we're going the right way. Level 35. What's gonna be at the end here? I feel like there's gonna be something big at the end. No! No what? This is wing. Revelio. Alright. So that was that. What else? Revelio, look around a little bit. You never have too much pork lump juice. It's just fun to say. Incendio. Mm. Books. Oh, oh, a book stand. Revelio. Anything cool in here? No, just a pile of dead bodies. Fine. Can I use Bombarda? Bombarda. So much more fun than using. Ha. Did. De Depulsa! One of the D ones. Revelio. Depulso, Descendo, Defindo. <sighs> so many. Damn, we are really climbing. Yep, we're definitely going up a mountain. Oh, which should have gave it away as to why. Now I understand. 
We were going down before. The whole idea is to go up the mountain. Cool! <gasps> oh! There it is! Hello. Hi. I'm here to help. I can take you somewhere safe. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh wait, no. Um, I would love to brush it, but let's... No, that's not what I want to do. It didn't even struggle! Let's get you back to the room. Deke's yes. going to be pleased. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, I'm so, that just made me so happy. Alright, we caught a phoenix. I'm so ready. Um, what else can we come up here? Wow, this is this place is gorgeous. Oh, there was the way down. Pi Poid Seer Coast? Okay. I should investigate. Oh yes we should. Yes we should. <laughs> It sounds like a horrible sound! Ow, you bum. Well, let's switch this back to incendio. I'm gonna throw everything at you. Gross. You eight-eyed nasty. Right. Revenia. Anything else around here? Dead bodies? What? What's this? What's that thing? I don't think I've ever seen these. Oh yes, I kind of have seen these before. This would be the, pul the Pulso puzzles, right? Like, I don't know. Maybe you don't have to. Maybe you don't have to freeze it. It'll just open and stay open on its own. I have to see what's down here. <gasps> oh, another Revenue. wizard's chest thing? How cool is that? Oh no. Incendio! Um, Rebellion. I have to do something with this. I'm not really sure. Do I have to put this somewhere? <laughs> I don't know what that did. Rebellion. Is there anything here that'll give me a clue? Here's some like whispering down here. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Confringo! Love to know how it's dangerous nothing has happened to me yet. Not understanding this. But yeah, it's wizard's chest. Guardian Leviosa. Guardian Leviosa. Oop! I would love this ch Okay, cool. Hmm. Does the chair have to go up here? I don't really know how to do- there's nothing- and I don't even see like a chest in here. The only thing that glows in here is this chair. And it's not very evident right now what I'm supposed to do with it. So I might have to come back to this one later. I think it'll still show up on my map because I can- I don't have the slightest clue right now. Could the f 
Phoenix be in there? Confringo! Confringo! This looks so sin- Oh! Ha! <laughs> that worked. I decided to come back. And see what- oh, cool. So there was like a chest down here. I'm glad I came down- I'm glad I came back down here because I love getting collectibles for my room. Hey! Did you find the phoenix? I did. Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable! Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to- you cannot wait to what? My heavens! The phoenix gets a vivarium all to itself. Spoiled brat! Oh my god! It got huge. The room. What a beauty! This is awesome. You keep it close. I'm gonna cry, dude. I'm gonna cry. That'll be my fancy writing quill. Cool. I gotta find more. Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the room of requirement. Look at all you've done and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix is safe now. Because of you. I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words and also grateful to have been of assistance to someone like yourself. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you need him. No, I haven't seen eyebrows like yours in years. I love your eyebrows, Deke. Wow! How freaking cool is that? Oh, wow. And it just... Actually, I was like not super crazy about this at first, but now I'm like, hmm, that might have worked out. It just gave it more room so I can actually go around and pick all this stuff up. That's kind of cool. But now I get to redecorate again. Let's go. Let's go. I'm still convinced that this is going to turn into another annex. I'm just saying. There's this needs to be. Oh, I thought maybe I got some new outfits. Ooh, I got some new glasses though. Um, okay, I want to go see the new vivarium. Oh, it looks so cool. <gasps> Oh, 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 that means that we need to redecorate it again. So this is going to be, let's just do this for now. Cause I, I need this to go away. I need this to not be here. We're going to redecorate completely. Okay. Let's do pink and we have to make to make that and then all walls right so this can go no I want to just I must not be hitting it right okay botanical wall Right, and then that's pink, apply to all. There we go. I want to do, I feel like we can fix the floor. That's the botanical wall. Okay, so then that must be fine. This needs to go, this needs to go. Oh my God, there's, now I get all these new places to put stuff and maybe make things look better. Like I might, Maybe put the dung composters up here? I don't know yet. What are these? This botanical main ceiling? Awesome. This place looks amazing. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, I'm gonna put a sitting area right here. Why not? Okay, I can't wait to see this. It's mountainous and castly. Vivelia. Oh my gosh, I have to explore this. I gotta get my own flippin' castle. Rebellia. Oh wait. Confringo. Get like really cool sights and stuff to just I would just chill in here. Honest to god, I'm telling you guys right now, like I do play this game off camera, but like literally the only thing I'll do, like all I'll do after like a long day is just hop in this game, come into my vivarium, just kind of meander around, look at things, chill. It's just it's so it's so soothing and and relaxing. It's such a de-stressor. Oh my, this has got to be my favorite bot. Like, this is my favorite vivarium. Not only does it have the coolest, like, I don't know, door coming in here. It's, I love mountains. I love awesome views. That's, look at that view. It's gonna hold the best creatures in the game. And, oh, I'm gonna come here all the time. Like, just look at that view. That is so cool. Revenia. This would be a fun vivarium to build in as well, like, because I, I was kind of waiting to really build anything, because you keep getting stuff throughout the game, like, castle, like, castle-y stuff, so I'm assuming you can probably build Rebellion. a castle, or like a house inside of your vivarium, and I've been waiting to, till I get everything in the collection to actually invest time in building things so that I don't have to make any changes later. Um, or make fewer changes later, but I think I'm glad I waited. Cool, short pillar. I'm glad I waited until I got this vivarium, because I think this is where I'm gonna build something, eventually. You, you, you can't not, like, having like a mountainside, cliff top, freaking castle to live in? Yes, please. Ooh. I found where the third chest is going to be. This- this song screams Scottish Highlands, too. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Look at that. I wanna go somewhere that looks like this in real life. Does any such place exist? get our own like little pond thing too oh ah! ah, no where are you going I love you so much come here whoops I love you so much I I don't even know what you deserve the best name Fox. I'm gonna name it Fox after Dumbledore's. It just makes sense to me. I know everyone and their mother is probably doing that, but I'm doing it because it has a very special connotation for me. Fox. You're gonna be Fox. I'm gonna name you later. All right, let's do let's do another quest. Let's see what we have. Speaking of animals, I think since we just rescued a phoenix, um, I feel like the natural. Next thing to do is maybe do Poppy's quest in the Forbidden Forest. It probably has something to do with animals and poachers. Um, oh, we can do this map later. There's so many side things to do right now. There, I also got another well treasure, like another treasure map through a well, a talking well the other day. Speak with Imelda Rays. Um, that's another broom side quest that I could do since now we're in the mo more southern part of the map. Speak to Nelly. Oh. Oh, I need to go back and talk to her. Okay, but let's do Poppy. Let's do Bo Poppy's quest. <laughs> My bestie. Ooh, thread the needle. Oh, what a creepy place to meet in. Poppy. I can do this. I can do this. They will want to help. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? 
Well, they don't exactly know we're coming, so it's less of a meeting and more of a surprise, I suppose. Poppy is so badass. Like, she is so small and so mighty at the same time. Oh, so much badassery in such a small package. Kind of like my dog. <laughs> Jack Russell's, am I right? Sorry. They'll understand. Once we tell them about the Snidgets, they'll understand why we came and they'll want to help. I hope you're right. Perhaps they'll be able to tell that we're sincere. There's something about them that's so knowing. It's almost unnerving. Well, I can't lie to save my life. You can read my face like a book. It is both a blessing and a curse. So, like, you can trust me to not lie. <laughs> Centaurs are known for being quite wise. I suppose they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. What is it? It's what? nothing, truly. I've... We've no secrets to hide. That's right. We'll simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? Yes, of course. You're absolutely right. We'll meet with them, tell them about the Snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fu- Fu- Oh no, this is not good. What? What do you think you're doing here, humans? Please! We were hoping to speak with you- Ah! I suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur, and it spoke back. No! Never! We're here because we need your help! Enough! You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, little witch. Hey, 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 hey! Leave them be, Alec. We do not harm the young. It is not our way. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continue to slaughter beasts like us without a care. Not us. From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. They will leave here unharmed. True. Mark my words, Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. <laughs> Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? Now, follow me before Golden I... Golden Sigets are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means, yet. Please, help us find the Snidgets before the poachers do. Could it be? In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it and place it in the henge in the forest. I have hundreds of moonstones. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. Huh. I don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight, but to a moonstone. What do moonstones have to do with snidgets? And why was he so certain about where we could find one? Well, getting involved in a centaur conflict was not on my bingo card, which I don't know why it wasn't, because this is Hogwarts' legacy. Centaurs are pretty integral to the world, and so I can just go ahead and check that off. I trust him. Centaurs know things. He was annoyingly cryptic. Isn't Moonstone common? Yeah, I have a billion. I don't know, but I am inclined to believe him. What with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was his name? Doran. That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act now and ask questions later. I can head to the library and start looking into the cave he mentioned. Ooh. I'll let you know what I find. 
Okay, that was cool. I oh I don't know between her and Sebastian's like character side quests. I don't know which one's my favorite now because this got surprisingly darker than I thought we would with Poppy, and I think why I'm drawn more to Poppy too now. Like she's definitely I would say my favorite side character. Sebastian being like a close second I would say. But she reminds me a lot of Hermione. Like, she's very Hermione-esque for me, and I've always kind of looked up to Hermione as a character when I read the Harry Potter books. Like, I just, I vibed with her a lot. And uh, I, I see a lot of her in Poppy as well, and I really like that. I just, I, I feel very drawn to her character. Right, now I'm gonna go talk to Sebastian in Feldcroft. But not before I break into this house. <laughs> Mine now, demigod. Hello, Hamora. Oh, a demigod. Where is it? No, that's right there. Where was it? I just saw it. There it was. Yeah. Where's the dummy, guys? There it is. It's up here. Small framed. Ooh, I love getting the wall paintings. Yeah, I have one of those in my room of requirement. Okay, and then there was um, a chest here. There we go. Sick handle for a wand. I have so many wand handles, it's not even funny. I think I only have two more slots left, so I have two more left to find. Oh, that looks so cool with my wand. I have been using the I went back to this because I just think that looks really cool, but I don't know, I love switching them because they're so much fun to play with. I love these. These are so cool, but I do love this one. But this new one that I found is pretty sick. It's got other s fairly similar ones, too. Um, yeah, let's go back to that one, though. Ooh, I can't get over it. Okay, so... Revelia. Back to talking to Sebastian. Sebastian! Oh, an a lost relic from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. <sighs> Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll meet you. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Sebastian. I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. I cross-reference Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. Well, that's interesting. This is more complicated than we thought. So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice. Seems risky. It'll be worth the risk. Our biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. Anne will only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, we could be expelled. Let me handle Ominous this time. As for my uncle, He's not an aura anymore. What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. <sighs> yeah, this is gonna go well. Might your uncle report us to the Ministry? Do you think your uncle would tell anyone at the Ministry about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the Ministry. He didn't part ways with them well, from what I understand. He won't say, but I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. At least that's what she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. 
So, I'm not sure he'd go to the Ministry to report on his own family using dark magic now. Dang, okay. Well, very well. Good luck with Ominous, until we meet again. I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. Will do, Sebastian. See you soon. Oh, no, no. See you soon. I love how that sounds. I'm not blushing, you're blushing. I came to Hogsmeade because I wanted to go sell some stuff to Penny. And I saw two side quests, so I figured you can go pick them up. Have your reasons, but breaking into Alfred Lawley's home wasn't the brightest idea. Oh, I do hope Mary and her neighbors aren't harmed. Crispin. Excuse me, sir. Are you all right? Oh. Just barely. But I don't want to trouble a student with my woes. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I'm not so sure. Name's Crispin Dunn, by the way. <gasps> I trade in the surrounding hamlets. Do the most business in Aronshire. A lovely little hamlet. Just stunning gardens. Just the other day, the Daily Prophet ran an article on its scenic hedgerows. Actually, before I go on, I should ask. Are you afraid of spiders? No, I'm afraid of the freaking glasses that I accidentally forgot to... <laughs> to hide in the gear menu. Oh my god, while I was doing some in-between stuff, I must have switched it because that had a higher gear score on it, but forgot to hide it, so I didn't know until I got into this conversation because I couldn't see my character's face. So that would that startled the crap out of me. Oh man, that was so funny though. Oh my god. 10 out of 10 would do that again. Anyway, no, spiders do not bother me at all. Spiders don't bother me at all. You'd be impressed by how many I've dispatched lately. Lucky you. The hamlet's overrun with the vile things. And they're acting abnormally aggressively. I'm concerned about my customers, of course, but it appears that most of the Hamlet's residents fled to safety. It's my friend Mary I worry about. I haven't heard from her and I fear she's trapped in her cottage. Understandable. But why don't you check on her yourself? I oh, would, <laughs> but I have a crippling fear of the eight-legged beasts, which I, unlike you, seem incapable of conquering. I don't know what to do. Can you think of anyone who can help Mary? I believe I can. Why have spiders taken over the Hamlet, though? Why are there so many spiders in Aronshire all of a sudden? I honestly don't know. I've never seen so many spiders in all of my life. It's almost as if someone's breeding them. They've trapped the entire Hamlet in webs. I was lucky to escape at all. Mary always has a way with these beasts. It's very concerning not to hear from her. <laughs> I can't take my character seriously. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um... You know, let, let's just see what I can do. I'll try my very best, Mr. Dunn. Please do. If you can think of anyone that may be brave enough to help, I'd appreciate it. Thank uh, you. me. They'll find Aaron just southeast of Hogsmeade, just below the train station. I actually know exactly where it is, too. Tangled webs. Don't talk about you taking down that troll in the village circle. You certainly made an impression. What can I say? I'm famous. Let's go pick up this last one over here. Betty Bogbrook. I beg your pardon, but would you mind helping out an old woman? I believe I can. Is everything all right? Oh, bless you. Oh, thank you for asking. I'm Betty. Betty Bogbrook. And no, everything is not all right. It's my dear friend, Hazel. Oh, she's in trouble. Hazel? Yes. Oh, she's a unicorn. Known her for years. She doesn't like to leave the forest, so <gasps> I visit her once a week to brush out her mane and bring her some treats. Her coat is glorious. Well, the last time I saw her, we were violently attacked by a pack of wolves. Hazel, loyal friend that she is, leapt in front to protect me and in the process... I fear she may have been injured. I'm sorry to hear that. I want to help her, but she seems to have gone into hiding. Out of fear, I'd imagine. I know you Hogwarts students learn a fair bit about caring for beasts. Perhaps you could find my unicorn friend and get her somewhere safe so that she can heal. I have the perfect place! Oh my god, I better be able to capture her and make her my 
friend and pet and take her to the vivarium and live happily ever after. And the blood of the unicorn is so precious. Okay, my precious. Okay, let's just go save the damn thing. How did you become friends with her? I got How did know. you become so close with the unicorn? It was luck, truly. I came across her when she was a little golden foal. Didn't even have a horn yet. Oh, she trusted me straight away. We'd play together for hours. Oh, I do hope she'll be all right. Unicorn hair is a valuable wand core, and I suppose losing a hair or two mightn't hurt her. But I'm terrified those poachers will want her for her blood to keep themselves alive. <gasps> and that is more than I can bear to think of. Oh my gosh. I need to take these glasses off, like, immediately. I need I'll see what I can do. I'll keep an eye out for your unicorn friend and take her to safety if I see her. Oh, you've a good soul. I can always tell. Please, don't risk your own safety, though. I don't know precisely where she is, but I can tell you that her den is north of Hogsmeade. Ah! And although I haven't been able to brush her lately, I imagine she still has the brightest, most beautiful coat of her entire herd. Ah! I know what Remember, I'm doing immediately. You'll know her by her brilliant coat. I cannot wait for this. I have been waiting for this since I realized you could. <gasps> she must be here somewhere. Oh, uh, I saw her. Oh my god! 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 Oh, on, Hazel. Whoa. My bad. My bad. Akio. Akio. Oh no. No, come back here. You bitch. You ruined it for me. No, come back. Come back. Come back. Maybe I should put Livioso on instead. Stop it. She's gonna keep getting into trouble. These rocks have seen Livioso. You're mine, you're mine, you're mine, you're mine, you're mine, no, you're mine. Don't go anywhere, don't, no. Yes! Yes! Hell I yes! I back to a vivarium now. I should let Madame Bugbrook know she's safe. Oh my god, best day ever! Part 22. Yup, because we've had a lot of these moments. Wait a second, so like, this is always going to be a unicorn den. So that means... <gasps> ah! Another one! Another one! Oh my god! Oh my god, two! We're going for two! So I'm going to give me two! Two! Any for three! Do we have any callers for three? Anyone? Three, three? Hello, three! We got two! I mean you know. Freaking go! Can we get another one? Can we get a third? Oh my god, I have not one, but two unicorns right now. I might- I might come back and see if another one spawns. Oh my gosh. Madame no, Bartlett, I forgot to take these I off! Found unicorn friend, Hazel. Oh, what a relief! Is she alright? Are you alright? Do you have a safe place for her to stay? I keep forgetting to take these off because I'm so like- Sidetracked by wanting to get this unicorn, I forgot. <laughs> We're fine, and yes, I do. We're oh, both fine, and I have a safe place for her at Hogwarts. You have a kind heart, you do. I'm relieved and thankful that you'll take care of her. I shall miss my sweet pointy pony, but I know she's safer away from the poachers. <gasps> do give her a nice brushing for me, won't you? Oh my god, every day. Every take day. Take good care of Hazel now. Oh, I will. She's in great hands. Um, which reminds me, we need to switch. We need to take this off. Those need to go. Bye bye. Okay, that was officially the best side quest so far, hands down. Hands down. Oh, I have two. Yes. Oh my gosh, the moon cast would also fit in really well up here in my opinion um oh my god look at those they're so freaking cute this is so cool 
This is so cool. I can't. I'm in love. I can't get enough of this. This game. They just gave me a unicorn. This game is is single-handedly allowing me to experience all of my childhood dreams of being a wizard. Um, having a unicorn. And now you can probably see why I'm so addicted to this game. It is pure happiness in a game. I literally, I can't. I can't get enough of this. I want another one. I want all of them. I will capture all of them. Need to build a toy box for you guys too. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, it hurts. How cute. It hurts. So now I'm just kind of doing some side quest stuff now. And I'm venturing more into the unknown. There's a lot of stuff around here. A lot of pretty important things, too. I kind of want to make some pit stops and get those um, ancient magic things. I found a Dirichal den near one of the hamlets. Marnweem Lake. Revelio. Oh, what's this? Oh, let's go get this ancient magic thing while we're here. Oh, forgot to switch this back to my fire wheel. Um, what do we have? This Transfiguration and Accio. Take it out. Woo, nice! Perfect, okay. Let's do this while we're here. Should be pretty close to getting all, uh, like, another ancient magic bar. Revelia. Where is it? Oh. Hold on a sec. I'm stuck! No! It's okay. Whoop! It's like, I wondered what that Revelia. would do. Um. All right, I feel like getting this is not going to be as simple as I was hoping. So we clearly need to repair this. Repair. Repair. Oh, it's a bridge. I see. Let's get up here. I love having. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I see. Yeah. And where's Rebellion. the final one? The final one is out here. Or no, it's in there, but it's behind something. I almost would not have seen that. Oh, wrong one. That's it! That solves that. Let's go! Okay. Done and done. Revelio. That's pretty much it for that. Got some gold. <sighs> There's something below us. Ooh, wait. There's a chest. Or no, it's a bag. I wonder what this is for. I'm not quite sure what that did. Anyway. Let's go. Ooh. Seriously though, I'm like 50 hours into this game. Or I will be after 
today, but 50 hours in, still going with the story, still finding new stuff. That's pretty awesome. Nothing pleasant about this coast. What? I think this place is beautiful. But yeah, it is kind of eerie. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh, either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Sheesh. Sebastian. He's attacking. Of course I do. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych lead is here? Let's yes. go, quickly, before we're spotted. I'm behind you. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. Oh, where am I going? But it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. It's like, where was I going? All right, get ready for a fight. You won't get away with that. Nice. What? Well, let me pick. Oh, cause I got a full meter. Huh? Huh? What? No, you don't. Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. Thanks, buddy. Where are we going now? Oh! This was just a pit stop. Thestrals overhead? Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Dead. Not everyone does. Oh, not me. I know that. <sighs> Alright. I'm Jesus. making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence. He's getting all snippy with me. Revelia. Bestie, what's going on? Oh, okay. This is going to be fun. Uh, let's do Accio. Accio. Revelia. Accio. Accio. That do it, it did it. Oh yeah. Revelia. Nomad hat. Yay. Okay. Ooh, and it looks like there's an astronomy table up ahead too that I can do. Look at that view. Revelio. Whoa, what's that? Like a shield or a protection thing? Is that... Is that actually... Yeah, it looks like there's like a wall of protection something. Ah, let's burn this. Right? Yeah, that's what I have to do to get through. Confringo. Oh. 
But then you have a trial here. Oh, that's where the astronomy table is. I'm sorry we can both see Thestrals. It's certainly not something I'd hope we'd have. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold that thought. Hold that thought, Sebastian. Let me open. Come here. I have a perfect home for you. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? No, it flew away. No. Okay. Oh, this is a flipendo puzzle too. All right, let's switch this back. What did I have before? Transfiguration and this. I think I have flipendo. There it is. All right. Well, I got one new Thestral for my collection. Okay. Flipendo. That's one. Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. Do they have to have the same one? The same size? Slanted. Or is it supposed to be like a mirror? I don't really know. Oh, okay, sure that worked. <laughs> I'll take it. Um Yeah, I think it's gotta be Yeah, it looks like it's gotta be the same on the top and on the bottom. So whoops. Rebellion. So I think there's another one up there. This one's not as confusing. Nice. And then the last one. Oh, I can't use my broom? Oh, the Thestra comes back. Oh, yay! Okay, that's it. Got nothing on me, Merlin. Okay, let's do this table while it's still nighttime. This is it. There we go. It's a dog? It looks like a dog. It it is a, yeah, can canis can canis major. Revelio. Alright, so that's that. Let's keep going. Kill any of you trespass. Huh! Now if I kill you first. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. Nope. No plan! Leroy! Not quite. Oh, I was gonna block you, dude. I won't be Nice. I'm not worried about me. I should worry about you. Dead. Yeah. Wait. Not dead yet. Now you're dead. Well, way to go, Sebastian. Thanks for helping. Rebellion. What were you thinking? I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Now that was all. Looks like Ranok's loyalists were heading further up the path. 
Let's keep going. Hold on, I'm the one who who ran in there and started going in wands blazing. What? She can't throw shade at him. That that was all me. I deserve that. Revelia. But, you know, quite frankly, this game is way more fun when you just, like, run in there and just start throwing hands. Just start destroying people. What's this? Oh! Incendio! We're gonna need that for something. Ooh, is this like, um... Cave? An optional cave that we can go into? Let's go check it out. Oops. Oh, a Depulso. Neat. Revelio. That's a new one. See, I like that one. That was very straightforward. I still haven't figured out the other one from that one room <sighs> earlier in the video. With oh yeah, with the wizard's chest and the chair. Yeah, still haven't figured that one out yet. Alright, what else have I missed here? Anything? Revelio. Looks like we're all good. So onward? this over here anything? Nope. Let's go in the cave now. Revelio. Huh. Oh, something else over here. More money. Alright, I think that's it. Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver, but not. I'm gonna start throwing down some Whether venomous tentaculas. Repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Let's go get him. Who's it? Who's it? Oh, there's only two of you. Easy. I think he's dead. Is he dead? No, he's not. Stop it. Done. All of Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Rebellion. Nice, nice work, fist bump. No, I didn't want the chopping cabbage. The venomous attack. Ooh, what's here? Oh no, um... He's throwing random obstacles in our way. <laughs> of spells yes, that I don't yes. have equipped, generally, just because... I don't often use them. Outside of very specific circumstances. What the heck happened in here? Dear resident, your chicken coop... Resident of what? This cave? Your chicken coop inspection will occur in two weeks' time in accordance with the Ministry's investigation into rumors of illegal breeding of basilisks. Please ensure that your premises are toad-free and be reminded that the punishment for such illegal breeding endeavors is lifelong detention in Azkaban. Please contact the, Depar uh, the Department of Regulation and Control of Magical Beasts, Ministry of Magic, with any questions. Well, um, it looks like Maybe she was trying to hide, like, her chickens or, or whatever she was doing. She died in this cave, but somehow her chickens live on. So, I, I don't know. I'm maybe wondering if maybe they, the chickens doctored this whole ordeal to become free. They lured their master out here, and they murdered her in cold blood, and then set themselves free. <laughs> Oh, cool. we gotta go to the room of apartment. Okay, let's leave these murderous chickens before we're next. That's totally what it looks like there. That 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 note that note did not 
that that didn't throw me off. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right, and I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goals. Oh, will you be keen then, huh? What the hell? I love it. They're like basically sentries. Sentry guns. Sebastian, wait. Wait? For what? For what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lodgok said- Oh, your goblin friend? Stop it, that's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lodgok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. Oh, wow. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Wow. Agreed. Wow. So... I, th I thought he was going to get angry with me there and then ditch me. I was totally expecting him to leave. Can't go breaking my heart Rebellion. like that. Good to know that he didn't. Kind of interesting though. Like once we kind of threatened him to leave, he was like, "No, it's, I'm sorry. I'm sorry." What's this? Money? What? Back there, and I can't get it. For one, did you All see that? That was Ranrock's awesome. Loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. Thanks, buddy. I think he likes me. I think he likes me. Uh, at least down here. This this one's creepy. Why is it so, so creepy down here? What? That music. Right, let's keep going. Tower tunnel. Let's go, Sebastian. So far, so good. Charming. Charming. Spiders. How fitting. Yay! <laughs> Nice. Ancient magic throw also Rebellion. so good. All right. Uh. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, that's Sebastian. That's all you. Go for it. Uh, uh no, thank you. Did that kill it? No. Haha. <laughs> well, oh, gross. Nice. Oh, sorry, Sebastian. Boom. Not that yet. 
nasty. Stop it. Yeah. We've read the world of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. Yeah. Okay, what's down here? Is this the right way to go? Yes, it is, I think. Or maybe is this the right? I don't know anymore. What's the way ready to go? Who knows? Wait, it looks like we can get up here, though. Oh! Revelio. Oh, wrong, wrong spell. Incendio. Incendio. I want this. One nudge and that chest might have fallen. Feline oh, plates? I think three nudges at least. <laughs> Feline plates. Oh my god. I. My room of requirement is pink. Guess who also had pink everything? Pink office, pink cat plates in their These Hogwarts are determined office. To make a meal of us. Professor I'm sure Umbridge. Taste better than a goblin dinner. Bavelio. I think I'm turning into Professor Umbridge, and I don't know how I feel about it. That is too funny. That is kind of awesome, though, to think about the fact that we both have feline plates. I'm gonna have a set in every room. Rebellion. Anything else in here? Ooh, no, you don't! No, you don't! Roll! Okay, they're all dead. Oh, Alright, let's keep going. Ooh, cool. What's this? A staircase leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Somebody's here. Let's switch this back to Transfiguration. Incendio. Huh. Depulso? Oh no, um. Depulso. Revelio. Just, yeah, instant take out of those things. Look at this mm. place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. I was gonna say, there's gotta be a fight here. Search for rooms. Revelio. Perhaps we should search for. Oh no, we'll search for something. Okay. Which We've way? seen rune symbols like these before. I think. Do I have to hit these? Though? Yes, I do. Okay, so there's two right there. Oh, there's the other one. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's the way to go. So. Let's Incendio. check out these rooms first. There's a chest in here. Is finding these chests luck or instinct? <laughs> More like game design. Oh, 
our characters are all like, wow, like look at all these perfectly placed things. What's going on? And they're in a video game. Get off the chest! Get ba down! Bad. Bad. No treats. Off the furniture. Okay. Um. Boom. Boom. I'd imagine we need to find all three oh, rooms in this world. Oh, this one's behind. Incendio! Can't get out of here quick enough. Oh, that was easy. There we go. Oh, there's gonna be a huge fight. Cause there look at all these wig and well potions the game's giving us. Mm-hmm. I'm ready for it. Whatever it is. What is this? Oh <gasps> Isadora's journal entry. I have had a breakthrough. The power that I honed with my professors, with which I conjured and built some such pretty pillars, must be tempered substantially for the much more delicate endeavor which I now undertake. It feels like somewhat it feels somewhat like removing a memory, but the magic is wholly different. As I withdrew the merest whisper of pain from just above the heart, a faint haze appeared and then just as quickly seemed to dissipate. I sensed a surge of peace myself as though I knew instantly what I was doing was right. I wonder now if the haze may be contained, if memories can be stored in a pensive. Surely these extractions can be kept safe for further study. Interesting, okay. Sebastian, a journal entry. We should look for more. Why Rebellion. can't she have kept all our journal entries in one place? <laughs> Again with the awareness. Ah. <sighs> Troll in the dungeon. Look at those eyes. Okay. Ah, no, back. Oh, it's too late. There you go, kill it. No. Go! Back off! I need to heal! I need to heal! Why am I not heal? Nice! Got him. Oh! No! A double hit. Let's go and throw a cabbage. Ow. I was throwing a cabbage. Mind your business. No, no, no. Now I need all those wiggle well potions. No, you're dead. Nice teamwork. Nothing like an angry troll to bring friends together. Revelio. That was really good teamwork, huh? Okay. Can I not take any more fangs? Yes, I can. Wait a second. What is this? Looks like that can all be repaired or something. That's a massive staircase to repair, though. Um, so we came from down there. Why is this- That troll certainly made a mess of things. Debris everywhere. I want to try to switch this to repair it and maybe- Repair it. Ah. That was a piece of work. More than one. Revelio. Oh, this is actually where we have to go. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Here. Incendio! 
Yes! What's it? I can't wait to identify everything. Okay. Let's switch this back. Rebellion. Fight? Fight, maybe? Or just more information would be cool. Yes, there's another journal entry. Alright, let's read this. Such joy I felt helping my father after all these years. To hear his voice again, I cannot begin to describe how much I've missed it. I confess I was wholly stunned by the Keeper's reaction. I should have expected it. How can they stand by and do nothing when they have the power to do so much good? Who is Professor Rackna to tell me that I c what I can and cannot do with my ability? The audacity of all of them, judging my work without any real understanding of all that I've accomplished. I do have some hope. The headmistress seems somehow to understand what I was doing. When the time is right, I shall go to her. Maybe she may be able and willing to help. Until I know otherwise, I must continue my work alone for now. But I find, but I will find someone to help me. I will find someone else who understands the gift that we've been given and our obligation to use it. I will store what I learned safely away for the moment. One day, I will be able to share it with another who is like me. Maybe that's me. Is she talking about us? Ooh, I'm excited. A journal entry. Isadora was here. Regarding Leviosa. There's that. You're talking. Ooh, these picture frames in here are kind of creepy. Okay, let's go. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs. Save the you! <laughs> well worth it. <laughs> That's me every time I run up We're a better. flight of stairs. Oh my god, I'm so out of shape. <laughs> ah, shit! That was a close one. That was a close one. Almost fell to my death. Can I get to it from the other side, though? I'm gonna try to make the jump. Ah! Oh, you shoot. Okay. Maybe I can jump to the other one. Wait, what is this? Oh, I didn't even see this little offshoot here. Oh, I'm kind of glad I fell down there and came up here again because I would not have noticed that before. Everything works out. You know, I think this is about the same gap that the other jump was, and I didn't make that one, so... It's really worth a sack of whatever. Probably not. Another barrier. Ooh. We can blast through it, I'm certain. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. There's another journal entry. Six of seven. I feel more and more capable each day. My sense of purpose, knowing that what I'm doing is precisely what I'm meant to do, has never been clearer. The number of souls I have been able to help grows by the day. So much pain. And I have discovered that this magic itself somehow confirms that what I'm doing is right. Each time I breathe in the haze, even a little, it's as though I become more capable. I am being rewarded for my courage. Rewarding for, rewarded for using this magic the way that it was meant to be used. I fear, however, that I must find a way to restore what I cannot use in the moment. I do not yet understand its power and do not want to leave it to chance. I have an idea. It's not without risk, but I feel that the risk is worth it. Good news? No. This journal entry sounds worrisome. Lovely. Incendio! Another one. Okay. Revelio. Here's another. Why would we have to go down? It's saying to go down there, but that's where we came. Oh. Almost as good as if I'd done it myself. He's my personal cheerleader. Rebellion. He likes me. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora.
Who could she have been here with, though? Another rune symbol. Feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. There we go. We got that symbol. Could this be another area Isadora created? Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. Revelio. I think I found another note. Well, it looks like there's two more notes. Oh, maybe this is... This is the journal entry 7 of 7, so I wonder what that one is up there. How could I have been so terribly wrong? The, hid the headmistress won't help me. I tried to make her understand. She, like the others, is blind to the possibilities of what I can do. I have come to learn that I can rely on no one. But I am a more powerful witch than I have ever been, and I know that it's due to the work I'm doing. I shall not allow my magic to lie dormant, as the Keepers do. How I despise that ridiculous name, as if keeping power all to themselves is something to be lauded. I confess I have begun to wonder if I will ever find another in my lifetime with who I can share this work. If I do not, then I shall find solace in the knowledge that I have left them a trail to follow, a path from which they can learn. Perhaps they will do they will do what I cannot heal the world. Revelio. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. Maybe that'll be like the last pensive memory that we'll get to look at. Okay. What is this? The final canvas piece of the triptych. Okay. We've done it. Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. <laughs> Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on all of this. So is this the third and final Revelia. piece? Okay. Go back to the Undercroft? Yeah. I cannot believe the journey this triptych took us on. Yup. Feels this like a million it. years ago that we found Don't the first one. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Okay. Oh! Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. Whoa, it's going to be one of her memories. I we wish for it. Yeah. What is it? Let's find out. Okay. I cannot bring my brother back, father, but I can give you peace. Please, have a seat. Oh, so this is her Isadora. Side. <laughs> We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. Have you done? 
I took his pain. Thank you. He speaks. That worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something Bravo. much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Not oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. Someone will be. <sighs> oh, wow. She took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. Oh, no. no, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felcroft, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. <gasps> yes. Yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain, it's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care, if at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. So she can't show up in the painting. Please, talk to the keepers. If not for me, then for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? Quest complete. The Shadow of Mountain. That was a great quest too. They've all been fantastic, but this is fan this is even better. Okay, should we talk to him? I wondered if you might teach me how to cast a curse that you mentioned. Oh, which one? Uh, never mind, never mind, never mind. On the second thought, nope. perhaps I don't need to learn any curses at the moment. Yeah, Very no, well. we're good. Let's speak again soon. I'm okay. I, I don't found know one of Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You're welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. Hardcock's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. Yes. And... He better not die. He better not die. Okay, I need to go to the room. Okay, there was a couple things that I wanted to do in here, but I can't quite remember them right now. Um... Oh no. Let's go grab... Let's do a real quick, quick sweep of everything. Maybe I'll remember. In stone. Stone. Yes. Ooh. Um. Oh, I can't wait to decorate the room again with everything else I just picked up today. It was so good. Okay. You made marvelous improvements here. Um. I know I have another Thestral. That I do. So. I need to go. Which one do I keep it in normally? No, it's not this one. This is the beach one. Let's go put it in here. 
All right. So we have another fest festral to add to the family. Um, add beast to vivarium. There you go. I need some more nasal stuff. Oh crap, nope. Thank you! Whoops. No, 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 come back! I'm sorry! I always forget that sometimes whatever one you mess with doesn't always, um, it doesn't always, like, go to that, to that, that wheel. Let's go brush the toad. Where's the other one? Come here, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, come back. There we go. There's another measle, right? That's real hair. There we go. Where's the other one? Yes, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. A and of course I did it to the... To the shiny one. All right. Let's go to the other one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. First, another big cat needs a big stretch or a scratch. <laughs> okay. Let's oh, oh, I know what I wanted to show you guys. Duh. I found a ton of statues. Look at this. This looks so sick, right? It kind of looks like the ancient magic swirl. Oh, hello. And then I put another equally cool statue in the other one. Yeah, I don't know if I showed it off last time. Maybe you saw it when I was in here. But I think I was in here. Anyway, I found this massive, or you can make it bigger. I made it this big. It's not naturally this big by default, but look at this awesome hippogriff statue. That is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna come back and feed them and brush them later. Thank you guys so much for watching another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. I really hope you enjoyed this one. This one was a blast. I love that last mission. I've always really enjoyed all of the missions that we go on with Sebastian because they're always like very dark. I feel like we get a lot more to the story. And now it's very clear that he is going to be, th I, you know what, when she would ke keeps talking about in her letters, like somebody else who can wield this power, I kept thinking of our character, our character, you know, because she has the ability to wield this ancient magic where Sebastian doesn't, but he has a similar mindset of Isidora where my character is erring on the side of like, we. I don't think we should meddle with this type of magic where Sebastian obviously has a personal stake and has a reason to want to use the magic and take away somebody's pain because of his sister Anne. If you guys are looking forward to the next episode, make sure to like, subscribe, and click that bell button, but you guys already know what to do. Thank you guys so much again for watching. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.